Guys, this is Wayne all back for another lesson, and that is GMF by an artist called John Grant. If you've never heard of John Grant, absolutely fantastic. He's got a fantastic voice and just writes such great songs. And the last album, Pale Green Ghost. So honestly, if you've never heard him, you've got to check it out. And this one is the clean version. There's actually a few swear words in this. At GMF, actually, I'm not going to say what it stands for because I'm not going to swear because maybe me, me mum and dad or me children might be watching. So. So let's keep it clean guys, always blue. So, okay, so the chords to the verse, first of all you're gonna want the capo on the first fret, okay? And the chords are, so the verse is really easy, so you just want an E major and an A major. But what we're gonna be doing, so, we're gonna be doing it, an E sus four. It's adding, so if we're doing an E major shape and it's adding a little finger, so we've got like an A major shape with his fingers. We've now got the little finger on the on the G on the second fret, okay? So it's like a little add on and off, okay? And then we do the same on the A major. to like an A sus4 shape so that's just moving what will be I play it obviously an A major with my last three fingers because I've got big fat fingers so if you're playing an A major like that what you would do you'd move the third finger up one fret on the B string to the third fret so that will give us an A sus4 and then back to an A so just that part then two three four and one going to be doing that for four lines, there's four lines in the verse, okay, uh, the strumming, so down, down, or down, or down, 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 or down, or down, 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 or down, down, or down, or down, 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 or down, down, or down, or down, 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 So that's the verse. Now the chorus, there's quite a lot of bar chords in it and it's really quite complicated. So I'm going to go through this really slow. So the first chord you're going to want is a C sharp minor. Okay. So remember we got the capo on the first fret now. So that's acting as a nut. So this is actually four frets up. We've got the C sharp minor. I'm the greatest living. Then we want an F sharp major. Person that we're a B. Then to an E. Top of my E to the G sharp major, C sharp minor. Let me go E and go ahead and love me. B and to a G sharp major, a G sharp minor, F sharp minor, A to a D, C sharp minor, F sharp major, A to a D. So I'll go through that again really slowly. So C sharp minor. I am the greatest living F sharp major and a B to a D from the A to a D. And a G sharp major, C sharp minor. Go ahead, love me. A B to a G sharp major and a C sharp minor, F sharp major, A major to a D major. C sharp minor, F sharp major, A to a D. Okay, so that's the chorus, okay? So it does the verse again, which is obviously an E. The A. Then we've got the chorus again, which is the bit I've just gone through. And then there's one other different bit in the song where it's what I, you know, the middle eight bit where it goes, uh, goes to a G. So I should have practiced my D. Again, 
joints. So we go G. Practice my skills D. We go back to G. I should be D. Practice the F. It's a C major. Then we got an F. F minor. Okay, then the instrumental part is just going into the E and the A major again, so... So we do that twice. Okay, so the chorus is exactly the same except you, you repeat the, the last bit which is the C sharp minor, F sharp major, A, E. So you're going to be doing that bit three times because he sings the line You could be laughing 63% more of the time You could be laughing 25% more of the time Okay, so I've been wanting to put this song up for a while I just think, you know... Um, it's, it's quite an underground name at the moment, um, John Grant, isn't it? Just, I just think, you know, he, he sh this guy should be an household name. I just think he's he's fantastic. Me and my missus are big fans of him. So um, I hope you've enjoyed that, you know. I hope you've enjoyed the lesson. I've done it as accurate as I sort of can. So thanks, everyone, for subscribing. I really do appreciate it. You know, the more the merrier. Please, please spread the word and I'll carry on posting, you know, more lessons up. Um, and I will catch you for another lesson very soon.